Hello! Welcome to this video about how to attack a settlement and not die. Okay, so uh, here is I'm at, I'm at a settlement. This is not a mission, just a random military settlement. Uh, let, let's check real fast on the map. I'm in the red on system. I'm making sure that <clears throat> in that system I'm not wanted, at least to the faction, so it's a military. Actually, I have a pretty good threat level, 3. Uh, so why you want to do that? Usually just maybe for fun, just to see how strong you are in combat, if it happens you do combat. And the main reason will be to get material, because sometimes you may like uh, want to farm some material. And uh, personally for me, when I want some good material, I go to either military, industrial or extraction. These are my big picks. So I go there with my FDL because I prefer having a, a rather fast ship, not too big, and have decent shielding. Okay, so... <clears throat> um, I usually land by myself, not on the landing pad, just because I want to position myself in a better place. So I'm going to land close. This is, this is the AB section, and this is the command center. So the first place we're going to go when we land in the habitation. Right, so I have my Maverick. Well, I'm grade four. Well, actually, my Maverick C is grade four, and my weapon are grade five. But even though, even if you like, like have a grade three weapon, you're still gonna do fine. So basically, the first thing you need to be done is to actually disable the uh, the the alarm console on the settlement. Because if you happen like to kill somebody and they see you and everything and they call the like backup, the alarm go off, that Goliath thing over there is gonna attack you and everything, and people's gonna drop and drop ship and that can be annoying and can be very hard sometimes depending if you're stuck in a building and stuff. So the best solution before you actually go all gun blazing will be to disable the alarm and then you can well go trigger happy. The app is over there. <clears throat> so now I'm not wanted, so even though somebody wants to scan me, I won't really care. Uh, well, the door opening is most likely on the other side. So right now I want to get to the command center and disable the alarm console. <coughs> Sorry. Okay. And for that, starting at the app is good because you're, you're going to actually farm mats and everything. And also, it's going to be easier to get at least level 1 or 2 clearance from, in, from uh, an NPC. If you get level 1, it's still workable, but getting level 2 is going to help more. Alright, level 2. Taser gun, your best weapon. So in case you didn't know, the energy gun, when you go into the overcharge mode, you'll one shot any, anybody that doesn't have shields or shields that are not on. So that's gonna be your best tool to actually kill actually most, you can actually kill almost everybody with that and never be spotted. Oh well, since we're here. Oh, there's more people in there apparently. So I'm crouching as you see, so they cannot hear me. Another kill. So yeah, when you crouch like that, they won't hear you. <coughs> oh, there is no mats in there because I think I relog it by mistake to make the video, but... Oh well. Since we're already there, I won't be looting anything, but at least you're gonna see the principal. Well, that sucks for me. Mm -hmm. Alright, now he's not looking. Yeah, she's, yeah. Maybe she's looking at me. She's still gonna work. Oh, never mind. She's not looking at me. Uh, 
So yeah, when you start killing on people like that in a building, you want to make maybe make a little tour and kill like more of them because uh, if they see a, a dead body underground. Oh, you see, somebody saw a body underground. So it's not into attack mode. Well, it's on scanning mode. You see that? So the, the trick for that is, is just, since he saw the bottom of the ground, you're not going to call help, but he's going to look for something suspicious like you and going to scan you. So for now I'm going to evade him until he deactivates his shield. Because right now you have his shield and it's going to be annoying. I think he actually did. Oh yeah. Is now back to white on the minimap. <laughs> there you go. Oh, battery pack, perfect. So the only reason that guy, that, that guy should never heard me. It's just he passed through the door, in front of the door here, and drew like his little round and saw like somewhere like a dead body and like he went into alert mode. It was just alert, so there was no alarm. And there was nothing, so that's perfect. I'm being careful because I don't want to be scanned. Well, sometimes it's okay to be scanned, but in the open it's not. I'm going to show you what I mean by that. <clears throat> uh, because uh, when an NPC scan you, when he's doing the scan animation, you can actually have the time to change your energy gun to taser mode and then zap him. He won't put his shield up when actually he's doing the animation. <clears throat> Perfect. Well, actually, I'm going to go back there. Uh, that's a bit different layout than what I'm used to, but still pretty similar. I suppose here is going to be the security area. Actually, I'm not sure where the security area is. Well, we're going to find it out. Somebody out there, which we're gonna ignore him. Yeah, I think it should be down there. Usually, the security area where you can put up the alarm is down there. So I'll be silent. It's possible that a guard see me, but that's gonna be actually fine. Yeah, security area. You see that guy saw me? I'm going out. Perfect. That was a bit risky, but hey. So now I'm still level 2. I was hoping this guy was level 3. Perfect. Problem fixed. I feel like I can disable the alarm right now. It take my level three. I was hoping the guy running after me to tell me to get out of there was actually the level three one, but that was just unlucky. But still, everything went out perfectly. <coughs> oh well, yeah, I forgot. I cannot loot anything because I disconnected. So what happened if? If you're like uh, in the instant of a settlement, you're landed, 
and then you go to the main menu and go back and log back in well you're screwed you, you for the all the material you need to jump out and jump back in so now it could be a bit uh, still a bit dangerous because a high security plate, but the alarm is disabled, so we can maybe have some fun and just kill everybody. So basically, that's how you do the infiltration to disable the alarm. After that, you just need to be to train and be like good at shooting and know how to kill the enemy and have a good weapon pick. So that's gonna alert some people. I think, because I did that bit some noise. Uh, pretty empty command center. Well, just in case, even though uh, the alarm is disabled. I'm gonna still disable this thing. Why can I not disable the anti ship turret? Is it bug or something? Well, it doesn't matter anyway. It was by principle. <coughs> Alright, now let's wipe the floor. Why? Because, well, first to show you, you have to have fun. <laughs> There's really nobody here. A bit of disappointment. I guess I'm gonna go outside. And go to my ship while shooting people. Security guy right here. Please scan me. Actually, as threat security three, the enemy are a bit stronger. So if you go to a place one or two, you're gonna be less good, less strong. Oh, somebody hit me with a plasma weapon. And it still hurts, so you need to be careful. Yeah, even even if you engineer stuff to grade five and have good gear and everything, any kind of close range uh, plasma weapon like the shotgun or uh, the kind of uh, uh, the rifle, the, the plasma sniper, is gonna be very bad for you if you don't dodge it. I suppose something like that hit me or something. I don't. I'm not sure, but I took a big damage in one hit. But is everything fine? Well, I don't need ammo much, but hey. As you see, the drone's not attacking me. Actually, it's pretty empty, empty settlement. Also, keep in mind, I'm in the Maverick suit, so in the combat suit, the Dominator is, gonna, is also going to be a bit better. Oh. So when you see a mid case like that and you took some damage, don't hesitate, Final use one and take one so you don't waste anything. Oh, well, that guy's not alerted. Now he is. I'm kind of surprised usually pe with the sound people rush, especially at the uh, they rush at you more at a higher threat usually. I guess not today. Well, the only sad part is I don't have any loot for me, so I'm not looting anything. Entering pressure 
There we go. That's all. Where does this security guy? Oh, there you are. Yeah, uh, five face to face with no cover, but no match. So, as you notice, I don't use the plasma weapon. I use it on my Dominator, I use the, the Executioner. But in Marvel suit, I prefer using the AR-50 and the laser pistol. Is it better? I don't know. But for me, I prefer it. That's more, I think, more play style than this, which is better. Well, the one thing, though, I can do is go to the power building over there and actually well take the power generator at least i won't be there for actually no reason entering pressurized environment hi bye oh that actually maybe gonna attract people when it's soft Oh yeah, it's gonna be empty, but oh well. So the place you get the best loot for like rare material is usually gonna be here, the power center and the command center. And you can get a few also in specific containers inside like a storage or extraction building. But abs more likely generic stuff, but those generic stuff sometimes you may need them actually. As you see, even if people say the R50 is pretty crappy, when engineered, you saw how fast I can kill uh, anything. So I'm gonna save some power. I'm gonna do that. So since since I'm cutting down the power, I'm force I'm overloading the doors. So it's gonna stay open, and then recharging my suit. So that way, when the power is down, and I don't have to waste power opening the door and not recuperating the power. So now. It's safe. Well, I like to be efficient and save power. Attacking that military base on the tree was way easier than I expected. But as you can see, just a little inattention, having a guy too close to me. I took uh, my, I had my shield down and uh, took some health damage, some armor damage. So you always need to be careful. <coughs> so if you're careful and do like I did, teasing people, disabling the alarm, it should be a walk in the park. Leaving pressurized environment. Entering pressurized and if you don't reconnect like I do, you just get your mats. At least I'm gonna get something, so it was not a total waste of time. That takes forever. So when I get the the power gen the power regulator, I'll just add to my ship and hopefully kill stuff in the way. Oh my god, my frame rate is dipping just by that smoke. I mean, the frame rate is so unstable, I get 100 FPS there, and then looking here, I get like uh, 70, and then I can get like 50 in other places. And of course, my graphic settings are very low, sadly. And yeah, that guy over there is still chilling, no alarm, so it doesn't do shit. Oh, security guy! Uh, 
So yeah, I do find those weapon combo pretty efficient because when you think about it, technically the sniper rifle, well uh, the sniper rifle, I call it like that, but the executioner, the plasma rifle, that one shot remove the shield and the other shot will most likely one shot kill him, so basically two shot. The problem is the projectile is slow. If the NPC happen to move like strafing a lot, you will most likely miss a shot a lot of time. And also if you face a player, well, he will move. So this combo is a way more forgiving, at least to me. Now I'm shooting my ship. Alright, so... I'm just gonna go in my ship, I guess that's gonna be it. And hopefully that was helpful for some people. Because at first I was struggling a little bit and then when I got all the mechanic work and actually were using properly the taser gun, well the game became kind of actually a bit too easy because I was able to do these things when I was not engineer. Being engineering just made the combat part just way easier. I can be way more casual about it instead of just like ultra careful. Right now I was not be really, really careful. I was just going in shooting. So, alright, thanks for watching.